It's about lunchtime, so I'm getting kind of hungry. Caleb's gonna want food when he wakes up. So, I'm gonna make just like a chicken burrito bowl kind of thing, um, but in my Instapot. So, let's get into the video. So the first thing I'm going to do actually is put my hair up. I I mean, I do cook with my hair down, just not very often because, I mean, I don't want food getting into it, so. Sorry, I'm looking at the viewfinder. <laughs> then, as you should always do before you cook, wash my hands. Okay, right, now. That is done out of the way. Make sure my sleeves are rolled up. Let's show you guys all the ingredients you're gonna need. Okay, so to start, you need some taco seasoning, some black beans, some corn, some salsa, chicken broth, cheese, brown or rice if you're choosing. I chose brown rice. Chicken. So because my chicken is actually frozen. I'm going to do the chicken first and get it to cook a little bit first so I can get it to thawed. So yeah, I'll show you guys how to make frozen chicken in your Instant Pot. So yeah, that's one thing I love about my Instant Pot is that I can cook frozen chicken in it because I have a really bad habit of forgetting that I'm what I'm going to make and like forgetting to pull out the meat the night before. <laughs> Hence, I mean, I knew I was going to make this and it's still frozen. So there's that. The recipe calls for a pound of chicken. Because this is frozen, I'm not gonna weigh it out. It's actually 1.63 pounds, but I'm okay with having extra chicken. That's just me. Oh, I also have snacks because I like to eat and cook at the same time. cup of my salsa since that's what I'm going to be putting into there so this will get added to it the reason I'm doing that I'm going to eat some for the chicken to defrost so I can cut it up into pieces. So yeah, wait for that and I'll show you guys the rest of the recipe. Okay, so since I don't need all the chicken broth, I literally just put all that chicken broth in there because um, I was defrosting that chicken. So I'm gonna take whatever chicken broth is left in here. <coughs> And kind of measure it out. So I only need about a cup. The rest of it, oh my god, you don't need. So I just dumped out the rest here. I'm gonna take my cup of chicken broth and put it back in to the Instant Pot. Now let's get to the actual recipe. So I took the chicken out already. Um, it's soft, not cooked all the way, but it's soft enough now that I should be able to cut it. So, I put it on a paper plate because I don't like doing dishes, but I'll put that out of the way. Okay. You're just going to cut it into like one inch pieces. Oh, that's warm. So, it's actually cooked a little more than I intended, which that's okay.
thank you guys so much for watching. If this video was helpful in any way, please give this video a like and subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell so you get notified anytime I upload a new video. Now my kitchen's a disaster, so I'm gonna go clean it. Bye guys. So awkward. I was hoping to have this done before you got up. Well, you're slow. I forgot what else I was gonna say. Redo it. Stop looking at me!